The Qur'an, A Complete Revelation Translated and read by Sam Gerrans And those who look not to a meeting with us say, O oh, that the angels were but sent down upon us, or we but saw our Lord. They have been proud concerning themselves, and scornful with great scorn. The day they see the angels, that day there will be no glad tidings for the evil doers, and they will say, An exclusion without end, and we will proceed to what they did of deeds, and make it scattered dust. The companions of the garden that day are best in habitation, and fairer in resting place. And the day the sky with the clouds are rent asunder, and the angels are sent down in succession, the true dominion that day belongs to the Almighty. And it is a difficult day for those who spurn guidance while claiming virtue. And the day the wrongdoer will gnaw his hands, he will say, Would that I had taken away with the messenger. Woe is me! Would that I had not taken such a one for friend. He led me astray from the remembrance after it reached me, and the shaitan is a traitor to man. And the messenger will say, O oh my Lord, my people took this Qur'an as a thing abandoned. And thus we appointed to every prophet an enemy from among the evildoers, but God suffices as guide and helper. And those who are indifferent to warning say, Oh, that the Qur'an were but sent down upon him all at once. Thus, that we might strengthen thy heart thereby, and we order it in slow, distinct stages. And they bring thee not an example, save we bring thee the truth and a fairer explanation. Those who are gathered on their faces into hell, these are worse in position and further astray in the way. And we gave Musa the law and appointed with him his brother Harun as assistant. And we said, Go to the people who repudiate our proofs and we annihilated them completely. And the people of Nuh, when they rejected the messengers, we drowned them, and made of them a proof for mankind. And we have prepared a painful punishment for the wrongdoers. And Ad and Thamud and the companions of the commencement, and many generations in between, ellipsis, we dealt with likewise, to continue, and to each we presented examples, and each we destroyed utterly. And they have passed by the city whereon reigned a reign of evil. Can it be that they did not see it? The truth is, they expect no resurrection, and when they see thee, they only make mockery of thee. Is this he whom God sent as messenger? He had almost led us astray from our gods, were we not steadfast towards them. And they will know, when they behold the punishment, who was further astray in the way. Hast thou considered him who took for his God his vain desire? Wouldst thou then be a guardian over him? If thou think that most of them hear or reason, they are only as the cattle. Nay, they are further astray in the way. Hast thou not considered how thy Lord spreads the shade? and had he willed, he would have made it still. Then make we the sun its pilot. Then we take it to us in a gradual taking, and he it is who makes for you the night a covering, and sleep a rest, and makes day a resurrection. 
and he it is who sends the winds as glad tidings at the time of his mercy, and we send down from the sky pure water, that we might give life thereby to a dead land, and give drink to what we have created of beasts and men a plenty, and we have expounded it among them, that they might take heed, but most men refuse save denial. And had we willed, we would have raised up a warner in every city, and obey thou not those who spurn guidance while claiming virtue, and strive thou against them thereby with a great striving. And he it is who loosed the two seas, one sweet, palatable, and the other salty, bitter, and made between them a barrier and a full exclusion. And he it is who created man from water, and made for him blood relations and marriage relations, and thy Lord is powerful and they serve besides God what neither benefits them nor harms them. And the one who spurns guidance while claiming virtue is a helper against his Lord. And we sent thee only as a bearer of glad tidings and as a warner. Say thou, I ask of you no reward for this, save that whoso will might take away to his Lord and place thou thy trust in the living, who dies not, and give thou glory with his praise. And he suffices as one aware of the transgressions of his servants, who created the heavens and the earth, and what is between them in six days, then took his place upon the throne, the Almighty. So ask thou about it, one aware, and when it is said to them, Submit to the Almighty, they say, And what is the Almighty? Are we to submit to whatever thou commandest us? And it increases them in aversion. Blessed be he who has made in the sky constellations, and made therein a torch and an illuminating moon. And he it is who made the night and day a succession for him who desires to take heed or desires gratitude. And the servants of the Almighty are they who walk upon the earth modestly. And when the ignorant address them, they speak peace. And who spend the night in submission and in rising to their Lord. And who say, Our Lord, avert thou from us the punishment of hell. The punishment thereof is unrelenting, evil as place and residence. And who, when they spend, are neither extravagant nor miserly. And there is a place in between. And who call not to another God with God, nor kill the soul which God has made unlawful, save aright, nor commit unlawful sexual intercourse. And whoso does that meets with requital. The punishment will be doubled for him on the day of resurrection, and he abides eternally therein humiliated. Save he who repents and believes and works righteousness. For such God will change their evil to good deeds, and God is forgiving, merciful. And whoso repents and works righteousness, it is he who repents to God completely. And who do not bear witness to falsehood, and when they pass by vain speech, pass by graciously. And who, when they are reminded by the proofs of their Lord, fall not down upon them deaf and blind. And who say, Our Lord, give thou to us from our wives and our progeny a delight of the eye, and make thou us a model for those of prudent fear. Such will be rewarded with the high place, because they were patient, and they will be met therein with greetings and peace, 
they abiding eternally therein, good are place and residence. Say thou, My Lord would not concern himself with you were it not for your summons, then have you rejected, so it will be necessary. Chapter 26 In the name of God, the Almighty, the Merciful. Ta Sin Mim Those are the proofs of the clear law. Thou mightest destroy thy soul from grief that they are not believers. If we will, we can send down upon them from the sky a proof before which their necks will be pliant and there comes not to them any new remembrance from the Almighty, save they are disinclined towards it. So they have rejected, and there will come to them news of that whereat they mocked. Have they not considered the earth, how much we have caused to grow therein every sort of noble kind? In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. And when thy Lord called Musa, Go thou to the wrongdoing people, the people of Firaun. Will they not be in prudent fear? He said, My Lord, I fear that they will reject me, and my breast will be straightened, and my tongue not proceed. So send thou for Harun, and they have a transgression against me, so I fear that they will kill me. He said, By no means, go with our proofs, we are with you listening. And go to Firaun and say, We are a messenger of the Lord of all mankind. Send thou the children of Israel with us said he, Did we not bring thee up among us as a child? And thou tarriedst among us years of thy life, and thou didst thy deed, which thou didst, and wast of those who spurn guidance while claiming virtue. He said, I did it when I was of those who stray, and I fled from you when I feared you. Then my Lord gave me judgment, and appointed me among the emissaries. And that past grace wherewith thou reproachest me is that thou hast enslaved the children of Israel. Said Firaun, And what is the Lord of all mankind? He said, The Lord of the heavens and the earth, and what is between them? If you are certain, said he to those about him, Do you not hear? He said, Your Lord. And the Lord of your fathers of old, said he, your messenger, who is sent to you, is possessed. He said, the Lord of the east and the west, and what is between them, if you use reason, said he, if thou take a God other than me, I will place thee in prison. He said, even though I bring thee something clear, said he, then bring thou it, if thou be of those who speak the truth. And he cast his staff, and then it was a clear serpent. And he drew forth his hand, and it was white for all to see. Said he to the eminent ones around him, This is a learned sorcerer. He would turn you out of your land by his sorcery. Then what do you command? They said, Delay thou him and his brother. And raise thou up in the town's gatherers, who shall bring to thee every learned sorcerer. And the sorcerers were assembled at the appointed time, on a day appointed. And it was said to the people, Will you assemble so we might follow the sorcerers if they be the victors? And when the sorcerers came, they said to Firaun, Will there be a reward for us if we be the victors? He said, Yea, and you will then be of those brought near. Musa said to them, Cast what you cast. And they cast their ropes and their staves, and said, By the greatness of Firaun are we the victors. 
and Musa cast his staff, and then it swallowed up what they falsified. Then the sorcerers fell in submission. They said, We believe in the Lord of all mankind, the Lord of Musa and Harun. Said he, You believe him before I gave you leave. He is your chief who taught you sorcery. And you will come to know, I will cut off your hands and your feet on alternate sides and put you to death by stake altogether. They said, No harm. To our Lord are we returning. We hope that our Lord will forgive us our errors, since we were the first of the believers. And we instructed Musa, Travel thou by night with my servants. You will be followed. And Firaun sent into the town's gatherers. These are but a little band, and they do provoke us, and we are a cautious host. Then we turned them out of gardens and springs and treasures and a noble station, thus. And we caused the children of Israel to inherit them. And they followed them at morning light. And when the two hosts saw each other, the companions of Musa said, We are overtaken. He said, By no means. My Lord is with me. He will guide me. And we instructed Musa, Strike thou the sea with thy staff. And it parted, each part like a tremendous towering mountain. And we brought nigh thereto the others, and we delivered Musa and those with him all together, then drowned we the others. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. And recite thou to them the report of Ibrahim, when he said to his father and his people, what do you serve? They said, We serve things fashioned, and remain devoted to them. He said, Do they hear you when you call, or benefit, or harm you? They said, Nay, we found our fathers doing thus. He said, Have you considered what you have been serving, you and your forefathers? And they are an enemy to me, save the Lord of all mankind, who created me and he guides me, and who feeds me and gives me drink, and when I am sick, he heals me, and who will give me death, then give me life, and who I hope will forgive me my errors on the day of judgment. My Lord, give thou me judgment, and join thou me with the righteous, and make thou for me a tongue of truth among those who come later. And make thou me among the inheritors of the garden of bliss, and forgive thou my father, he is of those who go astray. And disgrace thou me not the day they are raised, the day wealth and sons avail not, save him who brings to God a sound heart. And the garden is brought nigh to those of prudent fear, and hell is exposed to the misguided. And it is said to them, Where is what you served besides God? Can they help you or help themselves? And they are hurled therein, they and the misguided, and the forces of Iblis all together. They will say, disputing therein, By God, we were in obvious error when we made you equal with the Lord of all mankind. And the evildoers only led us astray, and we have no intercessors, nor any sincere, intimate friend. And were we to return, we would be among the believers. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. The people of Nuh rejected the emissaries, when their brother Nuh said to them, Will you not be in prudent fear? I am a trustworthy messenger to you, so be in prudent fear of God, and obey me, 
and I ask of you no reward for this. My reward is only upon the Lord of all mankind. So be in prudent fear of God and obey me. They said, Are we to believe thee when the abject follow thee? He said, And what knowledge have I of what they did? Their reckoning is only upon my Lord, if you could perceive. And I am not one to repel the believers. I am only a clear warner. They said, If thou cease not, O Nuh, thou wilt be stoned. He said, My Lord, my people have rejected me. So decide thou between me and them finally, and deliver thou me and those with me among the believers. And we delivered him and those with him in the laden ship. Then we drowned thereafter those remaining. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. Ad rejected the emissaries when their brother Hud said to them, Will you not be in prudent fear? I am a trustworthy messenger to you, so be in prudent fear of God and obey me. And I ask of you no reward for this. My reward is only upon the Lord of all mankind. Build you a proof on every prominence, amusing yourselves, and take you constructions that you might be eternal. And when you lay hold, lay you hold as tyrants. So be in prudent fear of God and obey me. And be in prudent fear of him who aided you with what you know. He aided you with cattle and sons and gardens and springs. I fear for you the punishment of a tremendous day. They said, It is the same to us whether thou admonish or be not of those who admonish. This is only a tradition of the former peoples, and we are not to be punished. And they rejected him. Then we destroyed them. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. Thamud rejected the emissaries, when their brother Saleh said to them, Will you not be in prudent fear? I am a trustworthy messenger to you, so be in prudent fear of God, and obey me. And I ask of you no reward for this. My reward is only upon the Lord of all mankind. Are you to be left secure in what is here among gardens and springs and tilled fields and date palms with slender spathes and to hew out dwellings from the mountains skillfully? So be in prudent fear of God and obey me and obey not the command of the committers of excess, those who spread corruption in the earth and do not write. They said, Thou art but one beguiled, thou art only a mortal like us, and bring thou a proof if thou be of those who speak the truth. He said, This is a she-camel. She has drink, and you have drink, on a day appointed. And touch her not with evil, for then will there take you the punishment of a tremendous day. But they brutally slaughtered her, and they became remorseful and the punishment took them. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. The people of Lut rejected the emissaries, when their brother Lut said to them, Will you not be in prudent fear? I am a trustworthy messenger to you, so be in prudent fear of God and obey me. And I ask of you no reward for this. My reward is only upon the Lord of all mankind. Of all mankind, do you approach the males and leave what your Lord created for you among your wives? The truth is, you are a transgressing people. They said, If thou cease not, O Lut, thou wilt be of those turned out. He said, I am of those who abhor your deeds. My Lord, deliver thou me and my household from what they do. 
and we delivered him and his household all together, save an old woman among those who stayed behind. Then we annihilated the others, and we rained upon them a rain, and evil is the rain of those who have been warned. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. And the companions of the woods rejected the emissaries. When Shuaib said to them, Will you not be in prudent fear? I am a trustworthy messenger to you, so be in prudent fear of God and obey me. And I ask of you no reward for it. My reward is only upon the Lord of all mankind. Fulfill the measure, and be not of those who cause loss and weigh with the straight balance, and deprive not men of their things, and commit not evil in the earth working corruption, and be in prudent fear of him who created you, and the great company of the former peoples. They said, Thou art but one beguiled, and thou art only a mortal like us, and we consider thee a liar, then cause thou pieces of the sky to fall upon us, if thou be of those who speak the truth. He said, My Lord knows best what you do. And they rejected him. Then there took them the punishment of the day of a covering darkness. It was the punishment of a tremendous day. In that is a proof, but most of them are not believers. And thy Lord, he is the mighty, the merciful. And it is a successive revelation of the Lord of all mankind, brought down by the faithful spirit upon thy heart, that thou be among the warners in clear Arabic speech. And it is in the written records of the former peoples, is it not a proof to them that the learned of the children of Israel know it? And had we sent it down upon any foreigner, and he had recited it to them, they would not have been believers in it. Thus have we put it in the hearts of the evildoers. They will not believe in it until they see the painful punishment and it will come upon them unexpectedly when they perceive not, and they will say, Are we to be granted respite? Is it then our punishment they seek to hasten? Hast thou not considered, if we give them enjoyment for years, then there come to them what they were promised, what would it avail them, what they enjoyed? And we destroyed no city, save it had warners, as a reminder. And we were not wrongdoers, and the shaitans did not bring it down. And it does not behoove them, and they are not able. They are excluded from the hearing. And call thou not with God to another God, lest thou be of those punished, and warn thou thy close relatives and lower thou thy wing to those who follow thee among the believers. And if they oppose thee, say thou, I am innocent of what you do. And place thou thy trust in the mighty, the merciful. He who sees thee when thou risest, and thy going to and fro among those who submit, he is the hearing, the knowing. Shall I inform you upon whom the shaitans descend? They descend upon every false deceiver. They give ear, but most of them are liars. And the poets, the misguided, follow them. Hast thou not considered how they wander in every valley, and that they say what they do not, save those who heed warning and do deeds of righteousness and remember God much and help themselves after they have been wronged. And those who do wrong will come to know to what place of return they will be returned. Chapter 27 
in the name of God the Almighty, the Merciful. Bar Seen Those are the proofs of the Qur'an and a clear decree, guidance and glad tidings for the believers, those who uphold the duty and give the purity, and of the hereafter they are certain. Those who believe not in the hereafter, we have made their works fair to them, so they wander blindly. These are they for whom is the evil of punishment, and in the hereafter are they those most in loss. And thou receivest the Qur'an from the presence of one wise, knowing. When Musa said to his people, I perceive a fire, I will bring you intelligence from it, or bring you a burning firebrand that you might warm yourselves. Then when he came to it, he was called. Blessed is he who is in the fire, and he who is round about it, and glory be unto God the Lord of all mankind. O Musa, it is I, God, the mighty, the wise. And cast thou thy staff. And when he saw it stirring as if it were a serpent, he turned away and would not return again. O Musa, fear thou not. The emissaries fear not in my presence. But whoso did wrong, then changed to good after evil, I am forgiving, merciful. And enter thou thy hand into thy bosom, it will come forth white without evil, among nine proofs to Firaun and his people. They are a wantonly perfidious people. And when our sight-giving proofs came to them, they said, This is obvious sorcery. And they rejected them, though their souls were convinced of them in injustice and arrogance. So see thou how was the final outcome of the workers of corruption. And we gave knowledge to Dawood and Suleiman, and they said, Praise belongs to God who has preferred us above many of his believing servants. And Suleiman inherited from Dawood and said, O mankind, we have been taught the speech of birds and have been given every sort of thing. This is the clear favour. And there gathered unto Suleiman his forces of jinn and men and birds, and they were marshalled. When they had reached the valley of the ants, an ant said, O ants, Enter your dwellings, that Suleiman and his forces crush you not when they perceive not. And he smiled, laughing at her speech. And he said, My Lord, grant thou me to be grateful for thy grace wherewith thou hast favoured me and my parents, and to work righteousness pleasing to thee, and make thou me enter by thy mercy among thy righteous servants. And he inspected the birds, and said, how is it that I see not the hoopoe, or is he among the absent? I will punish him with a severe punishment, or I will slay him if he bring me not a clear warrant. And he tarried not long. Then said he, I comprehend what thou comprehendest not, and I come to thee from Saba with a certain report. I found a woman ruling them, and she has been given every sort of thing, and she has a tremendous throne. I found her and her people submitting to the sun rather than God. And the shaitan made their works fair to them, and he diverted them from the way. And they were not rightly guided, that they submitted not to God, who brings forth the hidden in the heavens and the earth, and knows what you hide and what you make known. God, there is no God save he, Lord of the tremendous throne. He said, We will see if thou hast spoken truth, or thou art a liar. Go thou with this my decree, deliver thou it unto them, then turn thou away from them, and see thou what they return. She said, O eminent ones, there has been delivered unto me a noble decree. It is from Suleiman, and it is in the name of God, the Almighty, the Merciful, 
Exalt not yourselves against me, but come to me submitted. She said, O eminent ones, counsel me in my affair. I decide no affair until you bear me witness. They said, We are possessed of power and possessed of strong might, but the command is unto thee. See thou what thou wilt command. She said, Kings, when they enter a city, spoil it and make its most honoured people abject. And thus they do. And I will send a gift to them and see with what the emissaries return. So when he came to Suleiman, he said, Would you aid me in wealth? But what God gives me is better than what he gives you. The truth is, it is you who exult at your gift. Return thou to them. We will come to them with forces they have no power to resist, and we will drive them therefrom in abjection, and they will be brought low. He said, O eminent ones, which of you will bring me her throne before they come to me submitted? A mischievous one among the jinn said, I will bring it to thee before thou canst rise from thy station, and I am for this strong, trustworthy. Said one with knowledge of the law, I will bring it to thee before thy glance returns to thee. And when he saw it set before him, he said, This is of the bounty of my Lord, that he might try me, whether I be grateful or ungrateful. And whoso is grateful, he is but grateful for his soul. And whoso is ungrateful, my Lord is free from need, noble. He said, Disguise her throne for her. We will see if she be rightly guided, or if she be of those not rightly guided. And when she came, it was said, Is thy throne like this? She said, As if the same. And we were given knowledge before her, and we are submitted. And what she serves besides God diverts her. She is of a people who spurn guidance while claiming virtue. It was said to her, Enter thou the palace. And when she saw it, she thought it a body of water and uncovered her legs. He said, It is a palace paved with glass. She said, My lord, I have wronged my soul, and I submit with Suleiman to God, the lord of all mankind. And we sent to Thamud, their brother Salih, that they serve God. Then were they two factions quarrelling. He said, O my people, why will you hasten on the evil before the good? O oh, that you did but ask pardon of God, that you might obtain mercy. They said, We see an omen in thee and those with thee. He said, your omen is with God. The truth is, you are a people subjected to means of denial. And there were in the town nine bands, which worked corruption in the land and did not write. They said, Swear one to another by God that we will attack him and his household by night. Then we will say to his ally, We witness not the destruction of his household, and we speak the truth. And they schemed a scheme, and we schemed a scheme, and they perceived not. So see thou how was the final outcome of their scheme. We destroyed them and their people altogether. Those, their dwellings are desolate because they did wrong. In that is a proof for people who know. And we delivered those who heeded warning and were in prudent fear. And Lut when he said to his people, Will you commit sexual immorality when you perceive? Do you approach men with lust rather than women? The truth is, you are a people in ignorance.